People power is an incredibly versatile effect. It fills an entire stage and packs down into a tiny folder. I've been performing this trick for over 10 years, and my favorite part is that I'm able to adapt it to whatever environment or audience I'm working for. The core effect is really simple. Six people come onto the stage and play a game of three simple elimination steps. Even though the outcome is completely random, you're always able to predict the outcome and winner of the game. But here's the cool part. People Power is a framework for your own larger routines. So in the 40 minute explanation, I teach you a three phase chair prediction effect. I teach you how you can adapt the basic routine to your own performances, and even the full routine I did on TV, where I supercharged the effect using some additional props and an extra finale. You're gonna see that performance right now. And while the basic effect just uses the folder and six spectators, in this TV version, I've added some balloons and that additional prediction at the end. Let's get started. This is no longer a magic show. Instead, this is a game show. I'm your host, Andy Gladwin, and tonight we will be playing a game with six participants, and I will predict not only who wins the game, but what prize they win too. So tonight's first contestant is in our audience here. Hi there, what's your name? Johnny. Johnny, would you come up and help? Please, all you have to do is stand in front of any one of these six colored balloons. You have a complete and free choice. Stand in front of uh, one of those six balloons. Go for it, you're inspecting our balloons, perfect. And, uh, okay, you happy with that one? You stand on the red for the red. Well, the one thing I didn't tell you is this is a psychic game show because I made a prediction before we started the show and I knew that you would pick the red balloon. But we need a few more players to play the game so we have a few more people. Come on on, guys. And I'd like each of you to stand in front of a balloon for me. That's great. Fantastic. Hi, welcome everybody. Perfect. So now we need to get to know all of you. So we'll go down the row. I'd like you to tell us all your names. So we'll start with you. I'm Christy. Christy? Yes. I'm John. Johnny? Kenzie. Marilyn. Demetrius. Sydney. Perfect, welcome to the game. Now I'm gonna make a prediction of who I think is gonna win our psychic game show. While I'm doing that, I want you all to think about what prize you would like to win if you win the psychic game show. So any prize you like, give us some thoughts and I will predict the winner. I think this should be it. I'll leave the prediction here the whole time so everybody can keep an eye. And here's how the game show starts. It's a simple game of three elimination steps. All you have to do is decide whether or not you follow along. So step one says, any three people pick up your balloon. So decide amongst yourselves, but any three of you pick up your balloon right now. Okay, everybody happy? Does anybody here want to change their mind with somebody else? No? Let's carry on. Step number two says, if you picked up your balloon, sorry, you're out of the game. I tried to give you a chance to change your mind, but you didn't. You may return to your seats. Everybody will give you a round of applause. The three people that picked up their balloon, you must return to your seat. That includes you, I'm afraid, return. Thank you very much. But the step continues. It says, of the remaining three, any two of you hide your balloon. Now, when I say hide, I mean you could put it behind your back, in your coat, whatever you like. Everybody happy? The final of the three elimination steps says, if you didn't hide your balloon, congratulations, you are the winner. That's Christy, right? So you two must return to your seat. We have a winner. Everybody give Christy a big round of applause for winning the Psychic Games. So come on over, Christy. But I said I would make a prediction as to who would win the Psychic Games show. I've left it here the whole time. Your name was Christy, which is why I predicted that Christy would win the Psychic yes. Games show. But Christy, there's one more thing we have to deal with. The prize. I said you could think of any prize. What prize did you think of? I thought of a teddy bear. A teddy bear. I know it's silly, but... I'm you could have gone that. for a holiday to Barbados <laughs> or a night in Las Vegas, but you thought of a teddy bear. Yeah, I'm kind of rethinking it now, but I guess I'm... Well, it's too that. late. It's too late. Well, I made one more prediction in my psychic game show, and I knew that you would select a teddy bear. And this is for you. I want to give it up for Christy. Thank you, Christy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much.
Whether you choose to use this full routine, my chair prediction test, or just the basic six-person prediction routine, people power is a rare stage effect that packs away incredibly small and leaves you open to add your own presentation and interaction with the audience. It has been used by some of the most successful traveling magicians and mentalists in the world, and now it's finally available for your show.